it's Jesse here. In English, you can add the suffix ish to basically any word, which is really cool. I say ish a lot too. So what's its equivalent in Chinese? Today we're gonna find out. One of the common situations is when you add it to numbers like six ish. So here it means close to or approximately. In Chinese, we say zuo yo. Which literally means left, right. Think it as you're leaning towards left and then right. So obviously it's not a certain answer. So how do you use it? Let's take an example. Wow, the dark eyes are so dark. How late do you sleep? About 9 o'clock. That's pretty early. Today is 9 o'clock. You still need to rest. Your body is not eating well. My age. You think I'm how old? Uh, I don't know. Hello. Another situation is when you add it to adjectives, like hungry-ish. So here it means kind of, somewhat. In Chinese, we say 有点 or 有一点. They're the same, meaning a little bit, kind of. For example, 你饿吗? 有一点. 这个特别好吃,你试试看. You can also add ish to a noun and it means something like that but not exactly like we are friends-ish In that case, in Chinese, you can say 算是 算 means to count so 算是 means count as For example, 我看你经常和Emily一起玩,你们是闺蜜吧? 我们算是闺蜜。其实她老是在别人面前说我坏话，我讨厌死她了。我听说你爸是大学教授，我爸算是教授。我爸是一名小学老师，但在我心里，他和教授没什么差别。Ish can also be used when you want to say something is okay, meh, it's just alright, on its own or add to another word, like Oh my god, I love golden retriever, they're so cute, right? Ish. If you're a Chinese beginner, you might say ma ma hu hu. I made a video about this before, us native speakers seldom say it. Yeah, like how native English speakers seldom say seldom, but we were taught this at school. Anyways, there are a lot of ways to say it's alright in Chinese. You can watch this full video to learn more. Today in this video, we're just gonna talk about the most common and simple way, yi ban ban. 你喜欢你的工作吗? 一般般 手术还顺利吗? 一般般 Alright guys, there you have it. Ish can be used in so many different situations. I probably didn't cover all of them in this video. Please let me know in the comments below if there's anything I've missed or if you have any questions about how to use ish in Chinese. Give me some examples. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!